Okay, good day everybody. Um, greetings from Trinidad and Tobago. Uh, today I just want to share a, a little bit my experience with Android, um, specifically Ice Cream Sandwich on the Sensation 4G. Just a little background on this phone in particular. This, as I said before, is a Sensation 4G from HTC. Um, it's a T-Mobile branded phone. Uh, the specs look like a 1.2 GHz CPU, um, dual core, 768 megs of RAM, which translates to about between 560 to 610 megabytes of available RAM, depending on which custom RAM you have installed. Um, it has a 4.3 inch Super LCD display, a 8 megapixel camera on the back, as well as a VGA camera on the front. Um, you know, physically to hold this is very, is very, it's very nice to hold. It doesn't feel too big. Um, coming from the Inspire 4G, it feels, you know, even smaller than the Inspire 4G, despite the fact that they both have the same screen size. It feels a lot like the Nexus One, if you ever had or, or handled one of those devices. But, but you have all the, the screen size you know, of a larger phone. Um, on the software side, I have a custom ice cream sandwich ROM installed from XA Developers. Um, I will provide links for these below. Um, it is also rooted uh, S soft meaning that um, the, the NAND portion of the, the, the storage on the phone is, is, is available for writing and reading. Um, as I said before, it's rooted and it is also SIM unlocked. Alright, so, I mean, if you want to get into the Android experience, this is a very good way to go. Um, I paid just over 300 US uh, for, for this phone, used on eBay. It was fully locked and everything, um, but on XA, again on XA developers, there are all the, the guides necessary to do all the unlocking itself, the SO, all of that. All it requires is a basic understanding of how to use a computer and comprehension skills, basically. Alright, so the phone itself, as I said before, is running a, a build of ice cream sandwich is a work in progress so it has a lot of bugs still um, but basically it gives you a very good idea of how ice cream sandwich will run on the phone um, it's very 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 smooth as you can probably see um, you know the, the interface is it has a lot of 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 innovation admittedly a lot of it was taken from HTC Sense which it's not necessarily a bad thing because HTC Sense does provide some very nice features um, and generally it's a very very smooth and, and enjoyable experience um, you know, as I say, this is just a widget resizing can be done for any widget a very nice feature um, you know, uh, a lot a lot of under the hood um, changes to the user interface performance wise is, is running very well very very well so as I said before you know it hasn't no it has never been a better time to get into Android um, especially with the introduction of ice cream sandwich um, and this uh, this particular phone is very powerful if you don't have um, enough money to spend on the Galaxy S2 this is a very very good alternative Alright, so I hope this video was informative and thanks for watching.